Hello everybody! It is the Epic Gamer Guy here, and welcome to the second update episode of my Skyrim Let's Play. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're like, where's my Skyrim episode? Blah, 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 Skyrim. You're like raging right now because I don't have a Skyrim episode for you right now. But I do. Um, if you go back a couple days, I released a bonus episode for Skyrim. So if you want to get your Skyrim fixed for the week, go watch that bonus episode that I released. It's 18 minutes. It has a lot of. I had a lot of fun doing it. I was just goofing around, and uh, there's uh, some bloopers and audio tests in there at the end as well. So it was. A, it, it's it's a pretty cool video. But the main reason I'm doing an update video this week, or this weekend I should say, is because there are some very important series changing updates that you guys need to hear. Now, I know what you're thinking, you're like, what kind of series changing updates are there? You can't really change the series any more than it is, it's already very good. Well, that's the thing. What I want to talk about is uh, basically how much time I put into the series. Let's start with that. So a lot of people don't realize that I devote my entire Saturday and usually Sunday morning doing the series. Let me give you a little breakdown of everything I do. Let's look at this. So three to four hours go into recording. Now I know what you're thinking. Why the hell would you record three to four, actually two to three hours? Why would you record for two to three hours? Well, that is me, that is audio testing, that is making sure all the recording stuff works, and that is just me recording the game. Now, I know what you're thinking, you're like, then how the hell do you get like 15 to 25 minute episodes out of that? I cut a lot out, okay, to save time and to just make, keep the inter interesting stuff in, but that's another story. We'll get into that in a minute or two. So that's recording, two to three hours to record. Then I compress. Um, the problem with Vegas is it does not take Fraps motion JPEG files. Fraps records, uh, the, the container is AVI and the codec is motion JPEG and Vegas doesn't like dealing with that. So I stick it into a program called Camtasia Studio 7, which uh, uh, you guys know if you watched my how to edit, how I edit the series video. Anyway, I stick it into there and I compress it and then I get one big long file that I stick into Vegas and I edit down. The compression takes about an hour, about, we'll say two hours to compress it because it's taking all, I'd say around, you know, 50 to 80 gigs of files and compresses it down to about a four gig file that Vegas can not only edit easily because it's not a bunch of big files, it's one big small file, it gets turned into an MP4 file that Vegas will take. That's the main thing with that. Um, so that's compressing. Then editing alone in Vegas takes three to four hours. That's intro, that's you know all the editing, that's audio levels, that's everything. That's three to four hours. Oh well actually, and that does include photoshopping. I'm sorry, that does include photoshopping, which is for the YouTube thumbnail, the outro picture, thumbnail I guess and the questions that takes all about three to four hours maybe four and a half hours if I if it's something really big so that's about how much time I oh well then then it's rendering in Vegas that's true that takes anywhere from like an hour to an hour and a half although Vegas has been updating a lot recently and I've noticed it's been improving speeds on my computer so it has been getting better but anyway that's another story for another year and I did say year yes I meant to say year if the Vegas file is too big, if it's over 2 gigs, I have to stick it in Camtasia again to compress it. That way I can send it over to Sean via Dropbox without exceeding my 2 gigabyte limit. Then he can upload it and then we're all fine and dandy and all of our pants are still around our waist and our belt is still buckled. Does that make sense? Uh, by the way, this is going to be like a completely uncut uh, thing. It's going to be one recording session because I really don't have a lot of time and that's the next thing I'm getting into. Um, because I've been on spring break for the past two weeks, I've had a lot of time to do this stuff for you guys. But I'm going back into school. Uh, this is my last week of spring break, and I'm going back to school. The thing about that is what a lot of people don't realize is I go to one of those schools where all I do is homework Monday through Thursday. That's it. When I get home, homework, homework, homework almost all night until I go to bed. And maybe I'll watch like an hour's worth of YouTube videos in there, you know, taking little breaks between all of my assignments. So not only can I not record content for my own channel, by the way, which is linked in the description. This isn't my main channel. I do have my own channel linked in the description, always there. And you can go check out my content. I upload two videos a day. I try to do two videos a day, one in the morning, one in the afternoon. But anyway, that's that's getting off topic. So I do have my own channel I have to run, and that, that eliminates recording for my own channel during the week. I don't record during the week unless I'm really lucky and I either really have an urge to wake half the house up when I wake up at 6 in the morning 
or I have an urge to to record like right before I go to bed, which would be kind of stupid because I'd be tired and be like, uh, uh, uh. recording during the week is not an option. So then when the weekend comes, I record it. Uh, Friday night, I recorded uh, my series called Epic Fridays, which is where I play a random game every week, and we just have a whole bunch of fun. And then Saturday is devoted to completely Skyrim, nothing else. And then Sunday is the only time left I have to record for my own channel. And this is where problems happen, because not only am I trying to record for my own channel, but there, we are, a few people and I are also planning some more stuff for you guys and for my channel. So we're doing some planning on that right now, and that will take even more time out of my weekend. So basically, what I'm getting to here, and if you've been sticking around this long, I thank you very much. I, I really do. You guys are awesome, and I really need your feedback on this part right here. The Skyrim series needs to become a less efficient series. Now, when I say that, it's not going to go away. The Skyrim series is not going away. However, it's professional standing and how well I edit it and how much time I put into it is going to change. I will still put two to three hours into recording it, I have no choice. I will still put the hours into compressing it, I have no choice. But when it comes to editing it, there are some changes I think I should make. The first thing is, and I need this is where I need all of your opinions now. The first thing is audio leveling. I think I am going to stop making the audio levels the same. I've ar in the game, I already bump up the audio levels so you can hear people talk as I'm talking. Okay, or when I'm not talking, it's about the same volume. But I always bump those audio levels up to make them almost equal. I think I need to stop that because that alone takes like, you know, 45 minutes out of the three hours that I edit. That's 45 minutes. Okay, I can record, edit, and have a video rendered for my channel in 45 minutes. That's that that's an idea of how much time I put into this. So that's 45 minutes of audio leveling. So let me know if you guys wouldn't mind me just keeping the audio levels all the same for the game. Uh, you would still have the subtitles and you would still be able to hear them, it just wouldn't be as loud. So instead of, it, it, you would hear me talking about at this volume, but at this volume back here, you see how that works? So it wouldn't be that much of a difference, and it would save me a lot of time. So put your, let me know your feedback about that below. Also, I have two ways I can edit to completely give it to you guys. That sounds really bad, by the way. That sounds very dirty. But there's two different ways I can edit. I can, and th th this is the new way I'm going to be editing. So there's, you guys have no choice in this, but you choose either which way you think would be better for the series. Do you want, see, I record everything everything and I cut out the boring parts where I walk around and stuff and I would probably still do that because that's not too much work but I think what needs to change is how I do it so let me give you the options first before I start rambling on about other things so either you guys can get a 15 to 30 minute episode every week that is completely edited completely professional maybe without the audio leveling but completely edited and completely professional or I can upload the like no that would be a nuisance but I could upload the like hour and a half's worth of me recording the game as one solid thing. Now that I think about it, I don't think I want to do that, but if you guys, you, you give me your opinions. Um, when it comes to this, I'm going to make the final say in every single thing, but I want your opinions. Do you want like a 20 minute episode that you can just quickly watch nice and easily, or would you want like an hour long episode? Frankly, I'm favoring the episode that will be edited 20 minutes short, sweet, and to the point. That's mainly the purpose of the update episode. If you have been sticking around for this long, I thank you. You don't know how nice it is. And I know a lot of people, a lot of people really enjoy update episodes because you get to really see behind the scenes. And then most people don't though because all they want is gameplay, 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 gameplay. One thing I will be doing is I will still let you guys control the series. The series will not go away if I complete all the main storyline missions. I will still go around, wandering around, finding things to do, but it will not go away, so don't worry about that. If I blast through the story, don't think that the series is going to be over, because I will still find things to do. Okay, that's really all I have to say, guys. Hope you guys enjoy. I'm going to end this video now. Have a great day. I am the Epic Gamer Guy. Please leave your feedback in the comment section below. I definitely need it this time. I hope you understand why I did an update episode instead of a full episode. And as I said, you can go back and watch the bonus episode, which will also be linked in the description below, with all of my other links and all of my other information. So without further ado, I am the Epic Gamer Guy, and I am out.
In addition to your choice, if you guys have any questions, comments, tips, tricks, or challenges for me, be sure to leave them in your comment below. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and check out all of my links which are displayed on the screen as well as in the description below. Thanks everybody.